two of the seven days, Paul Sikala, snow in the forecast for the city of Tucson. Yeah, that'd be kind of cool snow at the uh, Fiesta de los Vaqueros Rodeo. All right, thanks a lot, my friends. The season is young, but Coach Jay Johnson and the Arizona Wildcat baseball team are still unbeaten. 4-0, this after four straight games at High Corbett Field against UMass Lowell, in which the Batcats busted out for double-digit runs all the games, and in the series closer, Arizona will put up 20 runs in a 25 victory, collecting 14 hits and 17 walks. And gotta love how the young Wildcats were not intimidated. Get this. Freshman Austin Wells busted out for a home run and seven RBIs over the weekend. That's the round tripper at High Corbett. Cameron Cannon, who led the season off with the triple, is hitting 571, while Matthew Dyer is at 500. Now, I know the season is young, but as a whole, in the four games, 11 Wildcats have a batting average of over 300. Coach Jay Johnson, the Cats hit the road for Houston to take on Rice this weekend. Hey, meanwhile, it was a cold, windy weekend at the Hill and Brand Invitational with Arizona finishing 3-2 and two with the losses coming against Alabama and South Florida. Now, Coach Kendra and his later Wildcats will head to Palm Springs for the annual tourney in the Coachella Valley. First game Thursday against Missouri. Hey, it's been a tale of two teams in Wildcat basketball. Coach Adia Barnes and the Lady Wildcats swept Utah and Colorado. Well, on the men's side, Arizona lost both games against the Utes and the Buffaloes. Coach Adia Barnes and Arizona are now 17-8 and 7-7 and seven and seven in the tough Pac-12. And on the men's end, the losing streak for Coach Sean Miller and the Arizona Wildcats is now at 7. The Wildcats hope it ends on Thursday at home against California. We'll catch up with Coach Miller at tomorrow's presser while Coach Adia Barnes and the Lady Wildcats, they will travel to Stanford on Friday and then Cal Berkeley on Sunday. Hey, we're far from over with after the break. We will give you an update on Tucson's newest professional sports team, the Tucson Sugar Skulls. Learn how you can check out the new indoor football turf at the TCC and get your tickets. Also, the Rito Racetrack is in full boom, as is the Fiesta de los Vaqueros Tucson Rodeo this weekend. More sports, more energy, more horsing around after the break.